Here I am. It's stock grind time, baby. Ah. Uh. I unlocked the F-15 in my own time. I did it. Back to researching the ground attack and navy trees, or whatever, not the navy tree, the, um, the ground attacker trees. Played a lot of F-16. In so doing, discovered how much I love the F-16 again. Just in time to fly this fucking brick. This thing is a brick. But it's extra, it's, it's fine, it's just extra dog right now. Because we haven't got anything. All I've unlocked is some new missiles. It starts with two AIM-9Ls. I now have four AIM-9Ls and four AIM-7Ms. We have to go all the way to tier four to unlock the AIM-9Ms. Right now, I've almost unlocked the new boosters, which promise to make the, the plane way, way, way better. Like, I don't remember the F-16s being this huge. But maybe that's just because the F-16 is so good by default. Apparently, the F-16s matter even more, but I guess I never noticed the F-16. But this thing, oh, you notice. Let me show you. This thing is hell. With no AIM-9Ms in top tier, and with the performance of this thing, I have been struggling to get kills. I've been farming the AI. I'm just farming the AI right now, trying to like level up to AIM-9Ms and new boosters and stuff. I ain't got chaff yet, so I can't really pretend to do like radar things. But it doesn't matter because the jet looks really sexy and that's, that's really what we do it for. I'm just satisfied. I was satisfied to get the jet. It was one of the main things. And it's just something different to fly, you know? That's about it, really. How you doing? Let's play some War Thunder. It's a big baby. Where's an F-16 to compare to? There's none on my team. Do you even come with a seat? No, you you gotta grind the seat. Yeah. It's a sexy plane, though. The little nozzles that move around. So you're gonna start to see the roll performance really shit itself as we get over 900 and 1000. This is how the thing rolls right now. It's, it's not great. It's not great maneuverability. But that's because we haven't got the new boosters yet, which hopefully will help a lot. But yeah, this, this is like it's top speed maneuverability right now. It's, it's very dog. Spoiled by the F-16 for sure. Of course, this thing's meant to, um, BVR. But BVR kind of sucks in War Thunder right now, so it's not really the F-15's fault for that. But we're in, like, a really whack kind of thing. Also, the the plane hasn't really got, like, its good radar. It's meant to have the dominate everyone else, because Gaijin. So we're kind of just, like, flying low right now and trying to, like, well, for, live long enough to farm the AI for one. But just, like, get unaware 9L kills on people. The 9L doesn't have the anti-countermeasure countermeasure system, so it can be flared pretty easily. We have Sparrows. We have four AIM-7M Sparrows. But Sparrows also got made, like, really unreliable a few patches back. So it's kind of hard to kill them. I know because I played on the patch immediately before it. I just got, like, a sp wow. Phantom. I was like, oh, wow, Sparrows are pretty cool. Um, and then, like, a patch or two later, it's like, oh, Sparrows can't hit shit anymore. Shit, what the fuck? So, we're just doing our best. We got a lot of cannon, we got double the flares. When I get chaff, I'll be running flares and chaff and trying to radar more, I think. Trying to finally learn BVR in this jet. Because if I wanted to not BVR, I'd just be flying the F-16. But this jet is sexy, so I want to fly this jet too and spade it. Which means get all the upgrades for it. It is the F-15A. It's like a very early variant of the F-15. It's like the earliest, I believe. F-15A being the giveaway there. Um, it's going up against, here in top tier, some, some pretty like 90s or like late 80s jets with 90s missiles. Well, this is like a kind of a 70s jet at this point. So we can't expect too much out of it. One day they'll probably give us a better variant of the F-15, F-15C or something in a later update, like they usually do. But for now, we're really just flying it because it looks cool. And it's something else to do other than fly the F-16 all the time. And yeah, the uh, the Ace Combat skins aren't official, that's right, they're on War Thunder Live. 
I'm, I'm into Ace Combat, so even though I haven't played through uh, Ace Combat Zero, I did get the Cypher skin, because it's a cute skin, I like it. And uh, I'm scheming to make Jambo play through something similar in roleplay, so I'm getting into the mindset of an F-15 of this paint job. I want it to be second nature to me by the time I put her through that. Where's the sound mod? Uh, not existing? What do you mean? You know what really sucks at this tier is fucking... The Russians get this goddamn missile that has like radar missile range, but it's an IR seeker, so you have no warning it's coming. So sometimes I just like randomly flare because I'm not sure if it's coming to kill me right now. I would just not know until it kills me. It kinda just happens. See one of the RWO mod like one for your women. No, I know, I just haven't been bothered to make one that's good enough to my standards yet. I probably won't. I probably never will. That's like effort. Russian Blias. <laughs> There's a bit, yeah. There's a bit of Russian Blias. Alright, that F4 is down. I had to ask you guys if there was Russian Blias when I didn't know anything about planes, but also I fucking started playing... Uh, no, 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 yes, 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 no, no, yes, yes, flares, yeah, easily, easily bites the flares. But uh, once I played tanks, I didn't have to ask anyone anymore, I knew. I hope that's not really on me, because I'm fucked if it is. It ain't. How are we gonna get a kill here? Guns, that's how. Here we go. That's actually a good 9 out, I think. Surprising. Yes! Where'd the everyone go? Is he behind me? Oh! Okay. One kill is all we need to stop grind. It's enough. One kill is fine. One kill will do. Because now... Do I- oh no, it hasn't finished yet, I don't get my upgrade yet. I was gonna say I should have new boosters, but the map isn't over yet. Radioactive Wabbit says, is this game worth buying? And it always struck me as a money sink B quality MMO. It's, I would say, very high quality. If that's your concern, it's very high quality. Uh, as for a money sink, depends how addictive your personality is. If you're like prone to whaling, and you're into the things in this game, I would be cautious because it is set up to catch the whales really well. There is, at the very least, I pay like a monthly, uh, I pay a yearly subscription basically at this point to make this playable, like to research stuff. Um, without premium, I think it would be unplayable. Um, premium is, is the basis. I also have bought a premium plane, which helped me grind harder. So if you're happy to spend that much money on it, and no more. You can definitely make it work like buy premium and like buy a jet or tank, whatever you want to play. Just use that to grind everything else. You can do that. I did that with the F5C. It took me a long time to like actually get into the game though. Only with chat's help that I get into it. But um, but if you're like really prone to getting whaled, you should be careful because there's so much more shit that the game is encouraging you to spend your money on. Like that is really bad value. Like you skip the research boost. Uh, fucking buy these boosts, buy this, buy that, buy all these planes. It's it's not good. You could definitely lose your house in this game if you have no self-control. That said, if you do have some self-control and you're not worried about that, I think it's a very high quality game. Um, I'd say the, the, low, the low point of its quality only comes from when it really feels like they're biased um, to certain nations. <laughs> Russia. Um, in what they'll accept as like appropriate sources for how good something should be or how bad it should be but other than that um shit's really fun it's very high quality it's very fun if you like playing of these kinds of toys it's the place to do it both here and in tanks i got into tanks as well radioactive says do you have to be grind to be relevant usually it's a time issue for me so it like yes so you you have to play a lot of games to grind the research tree from zero to, to end game um, and if you don't have premium, or and, and or a premium plane, it's gonna take you fucking forever. It depends what you want. 
if there's a premium that you like the look of, uh, and you'd be happy playing that as your main thing for a long time, and then like the other planes just naturally come as you research them, then that's probably fine. That's what I did. I played the F5 for probably 500 games um, before I got to the top tier of the US3. Uh, that, but that was fine because I loved the F5C, it turned out. I really enjoyed it. I found it really interesting and fun. Oh, I forgot to drop my tanks last fight. That would have helped. Um, so if that sounds like you, like if you don't mind just getting one thing out of the premiums that you'd, you'd like and playing it 500 times in a row before you get any other toys to play at the top tier, that's fine. Or if you don't mind early stuff, if you're interested in the early stuff, then you can play early shit. But uh, yeah, it, 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 as Chad's saying, it's all divided up into different tiers. So you won't fly against you know, modern jets of World War II stuff. You'll always be relevant to your battle tier. It's just, you know, are you interested in flying old shit? I, I only like flying modern shit. So for me, it was I had to grind up all the way to the top of the US tree to get anything else I wanted to use. I didn't want to fly Spitfires and shit, you know? I'm, I'm beyond that in my life. I didn't want to do that. I like jets. And same with tanks. I, I don't have any interest in flying, uh, in driving World War II tanks. But I just bought a premium US tank that's like pretty modern, like 70s, 80s, and I was pretty happy with that. And I've, I've just been using that the same as I use the F5, just to grind out the rest of the US uh, army tree. And I'm, I'm getting pretty decent on it. I'm not, I'm not too bad on it at this point. You're Fuck. fucking dead. Poxy says, when you get the F15I, start dropping Mark 84s on nurseries and children's hospitals. Um, inshallah, never, my friend. Never. Uh, I'm a US tree only. I don't bother with any other tree. Yeah, nothing but the good politics of the United States here, on this stream. <laughs> Who have never, never, ever bombed a target. That was a war crime. That has never happened. What are we doing here? Oh, should I be flying here? No. Uh, we're just trying to, like, rat kills until I can get better shit going, that's all. Oh my god, launch, launch, launch. It doesn't matter if I die, just get one kill. Just one, get one kill for the stock grind. Kill the motherfucker! Kill him! Yes! Good. Now kill this one. What the hell is this? Okay, here we go. No, the F-16 is going to F-16 me! It's okay. We got one kill. I should have new boosters now too. Well, you know you don't gas? Because I forget. Cause I usually... I've been remembering to do it offline, but now that I'm talking to you guys, I forget to dump my fuel tanks. I'm very American. I'm overweight and full of gasoline. Oh, did I not win the last one? Do I still not get new boosters? I'm going to sh... Fuck you! Fuck you! I won't. I won't spend six golden eagles to finish off new boosters. I won't do it. I might even just sit here. In fact, I think my food's ready. I'm gonna sit here till that match finishes, and I'll I'll get my goddamn new boosters. Hang on. Be right back. I'm gonna get my chicken tenders.
got my damn boosters. Let's see how much these help. Apparently they help a lot. Now what are we getting next? Um, get these two. We, we want to get the A9Ms. A9Ms are just such a disgusting little missile. They really just do all the killing for you. So, we, we're just like, yeah, we could get flares and shaft and all this shit, but fuck that. We just need to get the A9Ms, which means we need to research two things in this tier. So, we need to make 40,000 RP, which is a bunch of kills, um, for, for us right now. Uh, but we need to do wing repair and cover so we can get there. Which one of these first? Uh, wing repair. Wingspan. Fuselug drag. Max speed climb rate. Is it the fucking same thing? Real strength, fuselage drag coefficient. This is like stronger. Okay, just read the bio. Increases overall plane's durability and flight performance due to weight reduction. Reduce air drag. Okay, I'm gonna go for cover. We want Jisoo too, but we'll have to come back for all that shit. Oh my god, don't forget to purchase them. Okay, so hopefully with the new boosters, this thing will be a little bit less of a pig. Also, if I remember to um, drop my tanks. Chris, your modern planes? I love modern planes. It's where I live. I love them. Man, I just dumped all these chicken goujons into my air fryer. I was like, I'm that hungry. And now I'm looking at them, I'm like, I'm not that hungry. I got like 30 chicken goujons sitting next to me. It's like a fucking flesh mass of fried... Not fried, of, of like, crumbed, yeah, air fried chicken. Like, I'm like, I can't eat all this shit. Not on stream, I can't. It's huge, it's like a, it's like a tower. Mm. Someone at Beegs and Jammy to dump my gas when I get to the fight this time. Eagle, why do you even bring all the fuel tanks? Because it's cool. Because on EC maps, it's cool to, like, have them all. And it looks fucking awesome when you're at the fight and you dump all of the fucking fuel tanks off because it's like you're taking your gloves off. It's sick. Holy shit! Are you fucking kidding me? Whoa! I mean, I'm not at max velocity yet, but I'm... I'm holy fuck, that's so much better. What the fuck? Yo, it's like actually a plane now. Oh my god. They weren't kidding when they said the jet really needs those... Shit. Boosters. Like, yeah, it's a lot slower at max velocity, but it's like serviceable now, I would say. Like, it's actually like doable. Now, one thing I've been told about the F-15 as well, everyone's complained about, is the wings rip off it if you go too hard. So we especially want to make sure we don't do any, like, negative Gs, because Pull then up. the wings will break off. Pull up. Why, when the other planes don't really suffer from that as much? Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up, that's why. Roll left. Shut the fuck up, US main, that's why. It's funny, that's right, because it's funny. Pull up. Pull up. Pull because the up. Soviet manual said so. The, Pull okay, up. gas. Pull up. Roll left. Lock. Yeah, okay, it's apparently apparently Pull a bad up. shot, my bad. Pull up. Pull up. Yeah, 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 this one. Did that immediately lose lock? I think it did. Oh! Get fucked. What?! Is it still alive? Yeah, but it's not shooting at me. It's okay. Kill red. Yeah, kill red. <laughs> Pull up. Pull up. Is 
swear to god, I gotta use my goddamn gun on this thing. So you get 9 M's. Get sparrowed! Get sparrowed, get sparrowed, get sparrowed, get sparrowed, get sparrowed! Don't hit the fucking ground, you dog shit missile! I hate you! Okay, we can turn off the auto flares, I think. Hang on, you're gonna go over this hill, and when you go over the hill, you're not gonna be able to terrain mask. Maybe. No, you got it. Fuck you. Maybe? You're going over a hill there, it might work. No, it's not gonna work. Yo, fucking- WARM UP, SIDEWINDER! I HATE YOU SO MUCH! WARM UP! Okay, right, shoot with height. Okay, you guys got him. It's cool, I didn't want it. You guys got him. Hello, we have 15 stock ready? We sure are! Hmm, that trick in the F-16 doesn't bleed as much speed. Don't do that in the F-15. Didn't want to kill anyway. I didn't. I didn't want that kill. I couldn't really fucking grind the AI. It's crazy how important it is to have 9 M's at this tier. They're so fucking brainless, it's great. Isaac says, I hate how half the Canadian vehicles in this game are premium. They also have none of the Canadian jets. Yeah, because Canada isn't a nation. It's not a real nation, Isaac, so... You just get thrown in as, like, American premiums. Sorry, Isaac. Just play Tarkov, where you can play the Canadian infantry presets. Anyone is in America? Where are the others? One is in Germany and two in Great Britain. One is in Germany? I guess Great Britain makes more sense because the Commonwealth, technically. Alrighty. Leopard 2A1 Nexus? What the fuck is that? Why has Canada got anything to do with it? Explain. Isaac says Canada uses the Leopards as their MBT and we made our own variant of slightly bigger gun. Oh. I didn't know that. I really would have figured Canada would get like all the exports from the US. Ain't you guys flying like F-35s and shit? I mean I guess a lot of allied nations get that from the US. Nobody gets the F-22 though, that's only for the US. What the fuck is chat talking about? What the fuck? What is going on? <laughs> Barbarian says, I've never seen Jet come out before in War Thunder, never gotten this far. Is this arcade or realistic? It's realistic. Um, I'm stuck around in the F-15 right now, so it, I suck and I'm happy to get like one kill around. If you stick around long enough and I end up playing the F-16 again, you might see some real shit though. Gas? Not yet. Don't gas till we see the enemy. Pull up. It's like a fear fart. Pull up. Radioactive says, We decided not to buy F-35s for a decade and decided to buy it at an elevated price. Ah, the art of the deal. Well done. Pull up. Oh, got off my volume up and down. Ah! Fury's too loud.
Fish mob, that's right, Croker. What do we got here? Bunch of shit over there. I don't see anything coming from there. Look for someone high that we can sparrow, maybe. Like. You? Oh! Yahoo! They're gonna evade. Now I'm getting shot at by something. And I don't like what's happening. Gas! Gas! Whoa! Shit! You guys are meant to say gas! You didn't say gas! That was when you were meant to say gas! Sparrow. Oh, you're so dead. I've got your ass. There's no way it'll miss. Gosh. And again. Oh shit. That one did miss though. Fuck you! Goddamn Sparrow, why can't you do anything right? right I'm gonna get out now. Whoop! Okay. I got one kill. It's fine. We're grinding. Soon we will have the AIM-9Ms, and we will kill many people, and we will grind the rest of the stock with that. God, it's gonna take so long. I have to farm the fucking AI more. I do. I have to farm the fucking AI more. I gotta remember. Farm the AI. Josh says, hey Beagle, you know about the bomber missiles thing? No, nope. what are you talking about? Azure says, one of the first video games I ever played was F-15 Strike Eagle 2 on my dad's computer with EGA graphics. He made me cut my teeth on learning how to take off and land aircraft, on aircraft carriers. Huh? Using just a keyboard and joysticks. This is super nostalgia. Hold up, the F-15 can do what with carriers? Hold on now. I don't know. You hiding a tail hook up there? No, just your butt. I don't think the F-15 can do carrier. This is a bit games. Right, right. Sorry, it, it sounded like... How foolish of me. It sounded like one of those, like, sim games from back in the day. My bad. Of course, it's just a video game. Of course it is. Sorry, we're such slaves to realism these days that I just took that and imagined a game named F-16 Strike Eagle 2 would not put it on a carrier. I was back in like the 80s and 90s, man. We didn't give a fuck. Yo, can this jet take off from an aircraft carrier? Bro, everything can take off from an aircraft carrier. It's called an aircraft carrier. What are you talking about? Mediocre says, what if this was a plane girl and you just non-consensually upskirted them? What if this plane was my wife? Woo! Jesse, what, Jesse, what the fuck are you talking about? It's an aircraft. It's a, it's a mechanism. It's a machine. It's not even a cyber disc. It's not even synthetic. Look, all you gotta do, Mediocre, like everyone else, you gotta remember, when red is within 10k of me, you gotta say gas! You gotta go, at Beaks and Jet, gas! Until I remember to do it, while chatting to you fuckers. Gas! Here we go! Gosh! <laughs> Gosh! That's, that's all you're gonna do! Oh! Oh, I'm fucking dead! No, I'm fine! I'm dead! Fucking shit! But I got one! Yes! It, it, it all works out. It all works out. So the, the big thing about the F-15 that really sucks compared to the F-16 is there's no HMD. 
So you have to put your nose on the thing you want to kill, which is so fucking, so fucking 70s. We hate it. Compared to the F-16 where you just look at things and they explode, which is way cooler. But that's okay. Because one kill at a time, we will eventually get to the 9Ms, or I'll get bored and play the F-16 for a bit today, or I'll get bored and play tanks with my new wolf pack. I got my new wolf pack I ain't even streamed yet. Why are you grinding the F-15? It's fun to, like, grind new things. I don't want to get all that shit. But, I mean, yeah, like, I'm probably going to like the F-16 more still. Just because of this meta. If they ever fix the BVR shit, then the F-15 would be better. Unfortunately, right now, yeah, it's a BVR jet and BVR ain't great. Holy god, look at that mouth. gear, that's all. That's standard. Say gas. I can actually dogfight a bit now. Like I've got some role to me, so I could actually like try not to just like do mutually assured radar gas. I need to have higher standards for myself. I can get more than one kill in a round. I can do it. Had it beaten into me from the when you start this thing of no boosters and only two aim two L's. No, it's okay. Like aim nine L's. I mean, no, I can do it. Yeah, this is a stream for Jeff Freaks. What's up, Jeff Freak? Why would you go into the ground? I hate you! You gonna make me do it with my fucking gun? Oh, that was a bad launch. Now I'm tilted. Come on, give me like one good launch, you fucking piece of shit. The forbidden radar return, it really is. Oh, it's there behind a hill. Clever. Clever phantom. No, you don't get to missile them. I want to missile them. No, you shit! <laughs> oh, shit, the motherfucker behind me. Ah! Turn into me, you fucker. And don't go low. You're gonna go low. Everyone goes low. What are you doing? You coming towards me? What you, the fuck are you doing? Oh, turn off the auto flare. Come on. Just any any kind of shot. Die. Die, motherfucker. Die! Yes! That? That's, that's one kill. That's, that's that's exactly one kill. Have exactly one kill. 
I fired seven missiles. I have one kill. That's right. Don't worry. See all that bullshit they do where they flare the missile and doesn't hit them? They're not going to be able to do that once they get 9Ms. Don't worry. By the end of the day, they won't get to do that anymore. And all will be well again. I just gotta get good, I just gotta gun more. Hey, I had to get good at the F5C. With guns. Why can't I just get good at gunning with the F15? I can do it. I can make it work, man. Yo, blow this shit up. Get more points. It's so fast. It ain't bad. It's got two big old engines. What are we listening to? This is Money in the Back K. Eh? You know this song? This song used to be the shit. If you say so. You never listen to this song, man? This is back in the day. Hey, Eric, how you doing? I haven't checked your PMs yet, sorry. I started streaming them being, um, affable. I haven't clicked on your pings yet, but I will. I'm right here, Eric, playing not Freelancer. Playing a thousand years ago Freelancer. Uh, the flankers are so big. Nice for four days, just chilling. Howdy, howdy, howdy. I've learned the flankers are pretty. The flankers are very pretty, Jet. I agree. This game has finally taught me the difference between things I didn't really care about enough because I was like a, I was like a fake Jet fan. I just liked Ace Combat. So they were like, tell me the difference between a MiG-29 and an SC-27. I was like, I don't fucking know. But this game has taught me those differences. This game has turned me from a average jet consumer into a real jet hobbyist freak. And it's also told me to fear the flanker. I think 29 a bit as well, but definitely the flanker. S-27s came with the F-15. They're also very good because they're packing Hold much more than missiles right now. Well, radar missiles. And they're very good at ground shit, which the F-15 isn't. And the meta is ground shit with top tier jets at the moment. I gotta swap this song next time it loops, but I'm busy flying. You reckon that launch is really on me? No, that's a fake return, that's not on me. That's not really on me. There's no way. See? It's not on me. Alright, where are we going? Gosh! Dump my gas onto the civilian highway! Okay, shit, that motherfucker coming through. Let's go this way. That's a terrible launch. Please don't look. Please don't look at my terrible launch. Not even a 9M would have done that. What? No, don't go for- don't go for my friend! Please, not my friend! Someone's fucking gunning me! Wow! Yeah, don't look at me like my like while I whiff. Holy shit, I'm at 500 Ks. This plane is not the F-16. It's not fly-by-wire, and it does not let you do infinite turns without thinking about it. This plane can actually lose speed. It has a lot of flares, though. Get that speed back, though, quickly at modern jets, which is always nice. Let's just crash that radar-guided missile into a, um, into a building. I guess that's bad in certain senses, like, you shouldn't do that. Okay. Because, you know, the people in the building, but it's good for me in a tactical sense. You know? Okay, can I please have a Sparrow kill as a treat? Yeah, here we go. You're so fucked. I've got you. Not them. It's my missile that will hit you. Okay. That was expected. Grind the AI beagle, what are you doing? 
Take your six missiles and go kill some bots. Get some kind of XP. Oh, but there's players that I could maybe shoot. It's too low. These aren't good shots, I don't think. Oh, no, now it is. Go, go, Gale Sengen. Oh. And that one hit me from there. Fuck. Mwah. I gotta. I, I think I legitimately have to try and gun more. The 9Ls really aren't gonna do anything unless it's an ambush, so I should only be 9Ling if it's an ambush. Because they will just get flared. If they don't know I'm there, I can 9L them. And if it's like a perfect head on, I can spare them. Like, it was like a good opportunity. But I should probably just be fucking gunning. Honestly, I got a lot of gun, cannon, ammo, music, yeah. Time to swap. I do have a lot of gun ammo. Yeah, what the fuck? And it's gonna be like the most re the most reliable thing I have to kill of at this tier right now, I think. Because the 9Ls just don't really cut it. If, unless the enemy is like totally unaware of you. I mean, that does happen, it's just... Not really on you if that happens as much. I guess you gotta sneak more, but... It's tough. How do I make a little exhaust go up and down? Is that throttle? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's moving. It's moving. Is it moving? I can't tell. Maybe when I go faster, it'll go downwards. I have three fuel tanks, so I can dump them all dramatically when I get to the fight. I want to watch this nozzle come down. It will come down. I will watch it. You would try and scientifically figure out why the nozzle would go down. Does it actually do it on this model? It doesn't only have 15s, right? I only learned about it recently, so I don't know. But but that that bit at the front, these intake parts, they actually like they swivel downwards and look sick. I don't know what makes it happen though. Pitch. Don't know. Andy says, I need to get better with guns, especially since I play prop planes. I'm shooting even an arcade. So I had to get really good with guns at the F5 because the missiles on that plane are grandmas. But then I got the top tier and I forgot how to be good at guns because I got F16s of M9Ms. And you just, you forget about guns. So I kind of lost all my gun ability. I think I'm going to have to learn it again with the F15. Because I can get like cuts inside people's circles. But unless I'm gunning them, the 9Ls will get flared if I know I'm there, and they usually know I'm there. I prefer to light. Most of the time you don't live till the end of the match anyway. Well, I'm optimistic. I use all the fuel in my F-16, so... Speaking of which, gas. I usually dump the fuel tanks by the time I get into a, a real fight, though. That Mirage is like, hey, wanna, wanna fucking crash into each other? What the fuck? Sorry, Tornado, not a Mirage. Tornado's like trying to fucking take me out. Tornado be like, you know what would make your stock grind even harder? Being stuck out of your plane for the next however fucking long. Okay, don't. No, I don't believe their lies. Oh shit, fuck. Now I'm fucked. Oh! There it is! My bad. I tried to do a move. That was the wrong move. 
Now I gotta wait. Fuck. Can I play a... Uh, no, flop crew. My bad, I was holding roll and pitching up at the same time. Don't mix two keyboard inputs on the F15. Don't do it. Not a good idea. Well, we learned that lesson. Now we gotta wait, because we're bad. When you crash, you have to sit there. That's okay, look, we're, um... Look, somehow we've almost already got cover, because, like, fucking two kills is 10k. It just takes so long to get kills. Look, we've, we've almost got cover. Then it's just wings repair. That'll be another hour. 26,000 M9M. We're, like, two hours cope. We're, like, two hours away from 9Ms. It's fine. Everything is fine. But yeah, meanwhile in army I got this thing, it's so sick. Here, look at this thing, this thing is sick. Bop, bop. Check out my truck, bros. Woo! Striker, oh yeah! Oh yeah, fuck you too, Nani. What is that, a shield cup? Why don't you suck my dick? Yeah, I got this thing now. I played it like once since I got it. I just picked it up on the sale because I knew I wanted it. I just haven't been playing tanks since. Yeah, it's a 105mm striker. You know what else it has? It's fucking crazy. Look at this. It, it gets this! And I've used this in like a, in a match. And it's so stupid. You just get like map hack. It's stupid as fuck. Why 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 would you give this to anyone? You just put it on orbit, and then you'll be just like doing the map, and you're like, hey, is like anyone around? And the drone's like, yep. And you're like, cool. It's so stupid. I love how stupid it is. And the gun on the the MGS striker, it's um. It's uh, unmanned, it's remote, so you can get shot on it all day and it doesn't even fucking matter. You just like hide and heal it. Don't even fucking matter. It's great. Just sit behind shit and just shoot over hills. You don't even give a fuck, you're just like head glitching. Alright. Come on, F15, you can do it. Oh, uh, when I'm talking about the fly by wire thing, Tim, I'm shorthanding for what I mean is. The F-16, like, does this shit where it basically, like, restricts the aircraft's performance to your inputs so that you don't fuck the aircraft's airframe up and you don't, like, lose too much speed. It's kind of like an instructor on all the time. So, in an F-16, if you don't, like, decelerate or pull your, um, air brake... You really won't lose speed in the turn, but you also won't turn very fast. It's like built to rate fight, basically. It's like just naturally rate fights with the inputs in this video game. It's easy. And I gotta remember, like, you know, other planes don't do that. Like the F-15, if you just, like, turn as hard as you can, you'll, like, go down to 600k and be like, Oh, God, what the fuck? What's happening? Whereas in the F-16, I'll just, like, put my mouse on the side of my screen and just start looking around like, <laughs> Subject says all modern jets come with blind spot monitoring and rear cross traffic alert as well. What's blind spot monitoring? How does it do it? your blind spot thanks so much that's why i added on afterwards how does it do it so it says you know when you look in your side mirrors and see a nice icon that says there's a jet in your blind spot no little red dings in space up that lets you know you're about to be speared by a friendly mirage i can't tell what anyone's talking about all right let's not rip our wings off again if we can help it 
No two keyboard inputs at once. Not allowed. Well, not rolling anyway. No rolling anything else. Andrew says, some modern planes that fly by wire would fall off the sky. They're built extremely unstable to be more maneuverable. Yo, I mean, all planes didn't even have hydraulics, right? All planes didn't even have hydraulics. You had to, like, you, you had to, like, be strong. You had to, like, actually pull the fucking flaps and shit. Just with your strength. Which is kind of nutty when you think about it. Kind of like air steeding. It's like you've got a horse and you're pulling the reins around. That's famously what it takes to be a good equestrian, by the way. Um, is not a combination of wills, you and the horse. It's to just fucking, with raw strength, pull the horse around. <laughs> That's how it works. When you see horses rear up at, like, shows, that's actually the rider literally pulling their front half off the ground of their strength. Horse fire sidewinders. <laughs> Just fight the horse, yeah. Be one with your mount. No, fight the horse. Fight the horse forever. That's how you get gains. <laughs> Pull up. Pull up. Tree! Pull We're up. fine. To her and the respect of the horse, you have to be stronger than the horse. Yeah, but if you earn respect to the horse, you've performed a bond and you'll stop fighting, so that's lame. Then you have to get a new horse. Release that horse. Hold up. Now you've got to get a new horse, you've got to start all over again. Gosh! Roll left. Roll left. <laughs> Shift is also my zoom key, so it makes me do like this fucking crazy looking fucking... When I'm like, dropping gas. Gas! <laughs> gas! Oh shit. Okay, ambush. The goal is to ambush. And then we're just gonna go away and do something else. Uh oh. Looks like I'm fine. Don't worry. Oh god, that's the red blob. Run! Run from the red blob! Kill red, yep, in a second. After I'm not running straight into the middle of them. Sneak attack them, I sneak up. Pull up. Sneak attack. They see me, it's not a sneak attack. This is gonna be a sneak attack right here. That's not a sneak attack, they see it. Fuck. This will be a sneak attack. Watch this sneak attack. No, you fucking aim no, no! Yeah! I despise the R27 ET at the most out of any missile in the game. Why do I keep trying to PvP? Just get- just fucking farm AI. Why am I so stupid? Farm AI. Do not let me try to PvP this time, just don't. I'm just gonna focus on AI. It's gonna be way more consistent. Why are you even grinding this chat? Uh, just for just for fun! You having fun, Beagle? I'm having so much fun! I'm having so much! If 
Have a little ball. It's gonna be fine, because once we get 9Ms, that would have been like two kills I ran. It's fine. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. What the hell does that say? It's just like a giant French dick. What is that? Oh, Russian. chicken. Damn, Harrier GR7, you slow as motherfucking shit. God damn, bitch, you live like this? Look how fucking slow you are. How the fuck you live like that? Bitch, I got my fuel tanks on still. Kill AI. Pull up. Farm Pull up. bots. I'll get way more points right now just farming bots. Pull Gas. That might actually be for me, oh shit. I'm out of range, surely. Dad, they're well out of range. Okay, my team got their asses. And I haven't wasted any missiles. So I can save them all for the AI. Ooh. Real target? Beagle, what's, th what's that blaring noise in your cockpit, Beagle? I don't, I don't know. I don't know what that is. Holy shit, that's a few of them. Uh oh, what's that beeping noise, Beagle? Uh oh! No, fuck that. Oh shit! Idiot! Stop trying to PvP, idiot! I can't fucking resist! I can't fucking resist! Stop trying to fucking PvP with shit missiles, you idiot! Stop it! Stop it! You would be done by now if you just grinded fucking AI! I can't. I'm, I'm built to PvP. That's what this game is for. It's so hard to get out of the habit. Alright. This time I'll remember. Missiles are for shooting down enemy AI. Guns are for shooting down players. Do not pop up into the air when flying against 10 reds. This time I'll remember. You watch. You watch this round. Gonna be a great round of point scoring.
Riley says, is guns for players in F-18 thing, or does it apply to the F-16 too? You mean F-15? No, no, it's just we have ship missiles right now. I mean, they're better than anything before, but they're not the 9Ms. And the reason the 9Ms are so good is they ignore flares, basically. So, when you fire them from the correct angle, it's basically a guaranteed kill. Almost guaranteed. It takes, it takes a lot of defensive effort to wave them off at that point. And if you don't have them, if you just have 9Ls, then they just get flared. Now, you see a missile coming in your flare, and it goes away. That's what we're using right now. We need the ones that go, actually, I think I will murder you. Those are the ones we need. Particularly because we are living in a tier and world of everyone else having missiles like that and better. So that's why it's stupid for me to try to PvP so much, because I'm fighting people where my missiles are going to miss. Plus, it's harder for me to lock them. I'm vulnerable myself because I have to get my nose on them. It's very finicky. Whereas most people are using HMDs where they just look around, free look, and they can aim like that. Riley says, last time I saw you, you were playing F-16 using the missiles all the time. So I don't know if your strategy changed. No, I'll do like a couple F-16 rounds. I'll show you if, you, if you've forgotten. No. No, no, it's just because we're grinding this plane out. This plane, in War Thunder, when you research new planes, they don't have any of their shit, and you have to like, grind it all out. So we have to research all the upgrades for this plane to make it good. Right now, it's kind of like, not a very good F-15. Get it? That's the issue. Okay, I'm not gonna PvP. I'm not gonna PvP. I will not PvP. Hold up. I will not PvP. I will I will kill AI targets. I'm not gonna PvP. Hold up. Don't even talk to me about fucking the Russian bias, Andrew. It makes me so mad. It doesn't actually make me mad, but it makes me go <laughs> in an irritated fashion sometimes. <laughs> okay, now I will fly through here, which you store for the F-16, see if I get away with it with the F-15. Gosh! Okay, there's my target, right there. Forget about PvP. Fight only the AI. I don't know if I can get away with this, like, directly under them run. in an F-15. In an F-16, it's no problem, because it's very maneuverable. Hello there. Fuck off. I'm killing AI. Leave me alone. Coward screams chat. Yo, I don't- I'm fucking grinding- grinding shit here! Okay, now I can come around. And come behind someone and maybe get like a kill off that. Huh? You're PvP. No, I'm not. Don't. I'm not. I'm not PvP. Stop it. Shut up. I'm not. Right. Your flares are still on. Yeah, I've got 240 of them. I think I'll just leave them on for the whole match, actually. Not PvP. I'm not PvP. I'm not PvP. I'm just off to kill more Howard series. That's all. That's for me. Oh shit. Get low. Get low, get low, get low. This could actually be a good ambush 9L. Nope, they're looking right at me. Something's behind me. Oh shit. Oh, this motherfucker. Oh, I lost all my speed because I'm not in an F16. Ah! Alright, this is the end, friends. Gotcha! We blow for each other's wings, actually. Oh, I'm dead. Roll! To be quite honest, it's hard to even live long enough to kill AI. I was the last one alive. That's... that's... makes sense. My team got swiped. That's alright. My team got fucking cleaned up. That happens. Hey, I hit someone with a gun. Oh, no, no. The real goal for PvE 
is to live long enough until the end of a round that your team has won that you can just go farm all the targets with air superiority. That's when that's that's what we're gonna do. He's gonna live. The objective is to survive. <laughs> Branch says if you ignore the PvP, it comes after you. That's right. Or I played a round with someone you'd like with that comment. It was me 2v1 against uh, one ally left who was rearming at the base in a MiG. I got all fucked up. I tried to take out the enemy MiG at their airstrip and I got all fucked up. I was flying home. I was missing like a... Uh, I was missing one of my tailies. So I couldn't really control at all. I could just barely limp back to base with no maneuverability. And the F-15 was taking off and I was getting Blair beep, 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 by the MiG behind me coming to finish me off. And I was typing in chat like, F-15, like... Just use, use me as bait! I was picking the map where the MiG was. So just use me as bait! Ambush him! Use me as bait! And they typed in chat as they were taking off the airship. They said, No. Don't worry, buddy. You're coming home! And they like flew right fucking past me. And took the aggro and then just jousted the fucking MiG and blew it out of the sky. While I went to land. What a Chad. What an absolute Chad. <laughs> Sometimes you meet beautiful War Thunder players. Base MiG pilot? No! Base F-15 pilot! We hate the MiG in that story. The MiG was the vulture. It's coming to eat me! To get the wounded gazelle. Correct yourself, Ingridon. Tying his base! <laughs> Cavalier of the German Crossing Gold. It's a very long title. It's very unwieldy. It's like the Avalard announce me thing. Oh, who am I speaking with? You're speaking with WRB, uh, PSN, Big Ounce, Cavalier of the German Crossing Gold. Oh, yeah, great. First name would have been fine. I don't use a title because I'm cool. So they didn't have missiles back in World War II? I mean, they didn't have... Buddy? Buddy! Pull up! Holy shit! Buddy! Whoa! What the f- Are you kidding me? You can't even roll! Jesus, you can't even roll in this fucking plane. I just, like, did a roll. All I pressed was Q and used the mouse. Good god. Beagle, why are you grinding this plane? I don't know! Just for fun! But god, that's fucked! You've yet to earn the respect of your horse? I'm gonna watch that while I wait for the goddamn match. That was so not even... harsh. F-15s do this in reality, though. Gaijin said so. Well, you think you know more about U.S. jets than the fucking Soviet infantrymen's uplifting primer? Shut the fuck up. Hold up. All F-15 pilots are cowards. Who have to keep both hands on the stick at all times because they're too scared to lose control of their aircraft. Hold up. All F-16 Hold up. pilots murder babies. It's easy to out-tactics them in the air by preying on their heedless bloodlust. Just tell them there's a civilian in the area to bomb and then you can simply get them from behind while they're distracted. Now watch this. In fact, I followed this person's maneuver is the worst part. Oh, look at that shallow ass fucking roll. Suck my dick. Fuck you, Gaijin. I did the same fucking move the bitch in front of me was doing too.
Yeah, the plane was just like, I don't feel like being a plane anymore. God, I despise them. It was so much easier before I knew about the Russian bias. It was so much easier. Before I went through this patch cycle with the new Abrams and the fucking... F-15. Before I knew about all the fucking shit. You do those premium wings, you do. We'll just wait for three minutes. That's cool. It's okay, 5% more strength. 5% more wing strength might fix this. Alright, don't do rolls. Do 5% more rolls. <laughs> when I get the 5% more wing strength. That's right. Riley says, if you want lore accurate tanks, you want Gunner Heat PC. That's the game that's the complete opposite. That's the game where I've seen an Abrams fight like... I swear to god, like 10 T-72s V1. And get hit like six times. And be like, I need to kill more communists. <laughs> Mediocre says, so is the player only up to real life specs once you've unlocked all its upgrades? I would assume so. But even then, you know, it's... It's only as real life as the devs can, ar like, fathom and arbitrate. Because the, the specifications of the real life performance of all these things are secret. Classified, which is why you constantly hear about War Thunder. I get it now, why, why you constantly hear about War Thunder leaks. Like I said last time, because it's not about arguing with other people on a forum. It's about arguing with the devs and being like, you motherfuckers, the wings don't rip like that. Look at this <laughs> fucking manual I snuck out of the Pentagon about F F-15 wing ripping. I get it now, I fucking get it now. I don't laugh anymore at that. People are like, oh, the War Thunder players are doing it again. I'm like, it's survival out here. You're fighting for your life out here, I get it. <laughs> I get it. But Jimmy, yes, on one hand, you're gonna get better performance out of your digital video game jet in a fictional, unimportant video game conflict. But on the other hand, think about how you're exposing state secrets and jeopardizing the interests of the US military here and abroad. Base, double win. No, I'm, I'm just kidding, folks, of course. Of course, nobody loves the United States military more than us here at Push.tv slash Biggs and Jam. You can, of course, you can take that to the bank. That's signed, of course. And just says War Thunder pilots are braver than real pilots. <laughs> braver than US Marines. <laughs> Base, leak your tech documents for dev attention. Doesn't even matter. No point even doing it. I've, I've fucking seen, I wouldn't, I, I would've just thought this was whining before, but I've seen the way the bug reports for the US tech goes in these patches, and it goes like fucking, okay, here's like publicly like kinda known knowledge from accounts from pilots and stuff and da 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 and observation about how this thing works. Okay, well we won't accept that because it's not an official source. Okay, well, here's a fucking... Soviet source that says this plane is actually better than you've done it in the game. Okay, well, we won't take that because it's not NATO. Alright. Well, here's a fucking... You know, fucking nothing because, what, you want us to get a classified NATO source about how it fucking works? And then people leak classified NATO sources. <laughs> Banjo says if... <laughs> what are the duck lovers? If Banjo says if War Thunder was a good game, they make an F-15 of canards. Why do you say these words? Pull up. The big thing right now with, um, not even the F-15, the F-15 is like the small fries, because the F-15 on dev server, like, the wings just ripped off, like, even just doing the simplest shit. But the big thing right now, or last month when this patch came out, was actually the Abrams, because... Apparently Gaijin is doing this thing where they don't increase the armor of the Abrams variants at all. 
like, really at all from back in, like, their original models back in the fucking 70s. And the reason for that is, like, they can't find fucking sources on it, so it's not real. So it's just, like, a whole bunch of people, like, just complaining bitterly into hell that, like, this, this Abrams variant has, like, depleted uranium inserts and shit. And, like, you know, probably a variant that's, like, 20 years older or something that is meant to extend the service life of the tank probably has better armor than the first prototype. And the guy just like, well, why don't you, you know, that's a nice, <laughs> nice opinion, Senator. Why don't you back it up with a source? <laughs> Croker says, oh, I've got something I should forward them. <laughs> no, no, don't. Don't do it. Okay, so what's going on? Is that a missile flying at me? No, it's fine. Everything is fine and nothing bad is happening. Wait. Fight AI. Remember, Beagle, fight AI. Okay, it's fine. You're not gonna gun me. I said you're not gonna- That's not gonna turn on me, no way. Fuck you if that turned on me. I'd shit myself. I'd shit myself at you. I'd be like, I'd, I'd be so mad. I'd take a big- Are you behind me?! Oh my god! He's a predator! They want to understand the enemy. How fucking close is it? It's that fucking- Get so close! Hide behind the rock! Gas? Oh, gosh! <laughs> the fucking- <laughs> the Oh, ah, shit! <laughs> the fucking zoom gets me every time. Oh, missile! Missile kill! Missile kill! Don't kill a friendly! Missile kill! Yes! What the fuck is that noise? There's like Christmas lights going off. Okay, the JA is on me. I will fly behind these protective rocks. You want to smash the banner? Yeah, next time you play Ares Combat, and you're like, why the fuck can't any of my AI teammates do anything? Remember what it's like to play this fucking game. This is what it's like. Oh, I, I'll just leave my auto flares on, actually, I think. That's a waste. Of a missile. Ignore that. Oh, nice. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, points. Fuck yeah, points. Fuck yeah, points. That missile missed because it was shot too close. No, I got it. Hey, I would like to lock on you, actually. I don't care. I'll fire it at that range. I don't fucking care. It would have hit, too. Oh shit. I'm fine, I think. I'm gonna get out of my plane. Anti says, well, it is entertaining to watch. I'm not convinced yet to fun gameplay. Okay. We're gonna take a break from the F-15 then. Hang on. Hold up, cut the track. What you're seeing here is stock grind. It is the equivalent of punching yourself in the cock over and over. Oh, I'm gonna suck a dick. You wanna see something different? Okay, hang on. Hang on. Choose a crew. F-16. Go. F-16, begin. Where's Nova? Where's my favorite? Now, I you still have bad rounds in the F-16, don't get me wrong. But this jet is a beauty. The F-15 right now, it's like you came to my house, you came to my backyard. I'm like, oh, hey, nice to see you. I'm just punching myself in the dick with a log, like a, like a log, like a piece of wood. And you're like, why are you doing that? I'm like, that's just something I do for fun. Now, let's hop into my sports car. And this is the F-16. That's the sports car. The metaphor doesn't even make sense, because, like, wouldn't the F-16 have to also be an analog to punching yourself in the dick of a piece of wood? But I want to go down that road, because that sounds just filthy. Haha! <laughs> Anti says, don't get me wrong, too. It's very entertaining to watch. Oh, I'm glad. No, but I, I, it's, it's a point of, uh... 
It's a point of facts now, I gotta show you like a fun jet. <laughs> 